two-time Oscar winner Jodie Foster has been acting for nearly six decades. Wow. And she's still at the top of her game. She was just nominated for a Golden Globe, a SAG Award, and a Critics' Choice Award for Nyad. And she's also starring in the highly anticipated new season of the HBO series True Detective. Night Country. Please welcome, for the very first time on our show, we're thrilled to have her here, the legendary Jodie Foster. <laughs> Yeah, that's ingenious. <laughs> it's great to have you here. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. This is my first. Yes, I Never know. Never done of you. I can't believe no, it. No, I was too scared. <laughs> Were you? Really? Yeah, I was a little scared. Well, we love you, so thank yeah. you for being here. <laughs> yeah. It's all legend. We're all very nice. <laughs> okay, we'll see. <laughs> um, I just saw you in Nyad, and so you were good. fabulous. Fantastic. That movie is, you people should go see that. Just to see Yeah, yeah. thank you. Um, you play. You played the coach of yes. Nyad, who was the, you know, the famous marathon swimmer, Diana Nyad, yeah. who swam from Cuba to Florida at age 64. Yeah. FYI. Wonderful. Um, and you had Annette Benning here, I heard. Yeah. Yes. yes. She was here uh, last week. Fantastic. Wonderful. What a job she did, too, in the water constantly. Holy she is. Goodness. My good buddy. I don't know how she did it. She did a lot of swimming, and I just... Stood on the I don't know. You, not we saw your you, 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 you looked, you arms, you looked but... pretty good. I wanted to <laughs> know what your workout was. Was that training for this movie, Nyad, or was it? I, yeah, it was for Nyad. I, I mean, mean if mostly. I had to take it was... my shirt off, I would want my arms yeah, to right? like that, too. But Bonnie, but you know, Bonnie's a trainer. Too. That's what she does, so I just yeah. wanted to do her proud. OK. But yeah, I guess that's why you took the role, right? Because <laughs> I... we were wondering, you know, because you're very choosy, I understand, about roles you pick, which you is a what? good thing. I like good scripts, and I will wait as long as I have to for one. Um, True yeah. Detective was extraordinary as well, and, yeah. and, uh, and with a great director, and so, you know, that goes into the choice. You know, it's funny, because we still remember you in Taxi Driver <laughs> as a little kid, and here you are, you know, mature. over 50, mature, <laughs> and uh, I understand that you think that these are the best years for you. Definitely. Mm -hmm. I mean, uh, I think something happened. I, mean, I can't take all the credit because I feel like something happens, like there's some sort of magical hormone that happens at 60 where suddenly you're all, you're all anxious and about your 50s and then suddenly you're like, ah. Oh. Yeah. And it's yeah. all good. You're completely content. You don't care about anything. Um, and the world, I don't know, just seems rosier. Am I wrong? Wow. I feel like every decade you <laughs> get more comfortable well, I, on your own skin, too. Mm -hmm, like yeah. Every time. Yeah. For me, that's <laughs> Also, the hot flashes are finished. <laughs> that's true. That helps. That's true. I like that. I've got five more years. I'll be there. That's right. <laughs> You'll be there. there. We'll be welcoming you Thank to you. the uh, Thank you for the, the new way. Thank you for the Fabulous Club. That's right. Um, I remember you. She mentioned Taxi Driver. I just remember uh, your role in The Accused, because I'm a former sex crimes prosecutor. That's a haunting role. Right. And I often thought about your performance when I was interviewing survivors. You won your first Oscar for that performance. Yes. Uh, yeah. 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 Now, I wonder, what have you heard from women about um, what that movie meant to them? And do you feel it changed public opinion at the time about um, rape? Because right. it's what, it still remains one of the most underreported crimes in our country, but... Right, right. Well, I, I think, you know, I was young at the time. Of course, I was, I think I was 25. Yeah. And... Um, scared in front of the role, really, of not yeah. really knowing how to... But there were so many women that came forward in my family, in people that I met every single day, and the statistics are extraordinary. I think it's one in nine women yes. who've been sexually assaulted in their life, and uh, um, I really listened. I mean, that's what mm. you do. You sort of listen, and, and uh, it, movies can teach you things, you know, can teach yeah. you compassion, and they can teach you a real understanding of, mm -hmm. of, of human behavior. Indeed. Absolutely. Well, now that we are going down your whole filmography, I'm going to move on to okay. yeah. Silence of the Lambs. Yes. Okay. So, <laughs> that was not a good one. Yes. So you also won an Oscar in 1991 for your role as Clarice Starling in The Silence of the Lambs. Now, at the time, few serious actresses were taking on the horror genre. Mm -hmm. So did that feel risky to you at the time? And did you have any idea how iconic that yeah. that movie would become and remains. Yeah. Yeah, Clarice. well, I, I think you just go with the beauty of the script and your instinct about it. And I knew that it was something that fascinated me and the character fascinated me. My mom was dead set against it for some reason. I think uh -huh. she read the script Can't and imagine was like, why. I don't know what you're doing. I just won an Oscar. And she was just like, why are you playing the part of somebody who's 
you know, quiet and, uh, um, and it's just really one of the most fulfilling characters of my life. Wow. Grace is pretty amazing. Well, the list goes on for your iconic roles, but starting very early. You okay. started acting at three years old. Your wow. first gig was in a copper tone ad. <laughs> and then you went on to appear in a number of movies and TV shows. One was as a kid in The Courtship of Eddie's Father. You were a seven-year-old bully. We actually have a clip of that, and we want you to take a look. Okay. Uh, Joey, why do you go around socking Eddie? I don't know. Well, well uh, Joey, um... I'm sure that your mother wouldn't think it's such a good idea. I don't have a mother. Oh, well, uh, then the you know, lady that takes care of you. I don't have a lady. Pop and me don't need one. Look, I've even got my own house key. What's so swell about that? Ow! Now, now look, Joey. <laughs> what do you remember about filming that? You used um, to be the bad guy, now you yeah. chase the bad guy. Well, I, I, yeah, I was always the tough guy, though. Um, I remember, I mean, the thing I remember the most was one day, uh, men walked on the moon. So it was in the yeah. 60s, and we all stopped, stopped working for a second. We went to the prop house, little prop house, kind of like a prop truck, mm. and turned on the black and white television and all of us watched uh, the man watching, walking on the moon. So that's probably the most memorable yeah. part Amazing. of that. Amazing. Wow. Very fun. You know, you, you have quite a filmography, as you pointed out. <laughs> well, yeah. it's my whole childhood. It's my entire <laughs> life. You started so. young, yeah. yeah. In Taxi Driver, which I mentioned yeah. before, you played an underage prostitute opposite mm -hmm. Robert De Niro. Yeah. You were only 14 years old, but you say that the men on the... Um, on the film were intimidated by you, a 14. Why is that? Yeah. I was 12, so, um, oh, but they were, 12, they were, they were, it came out when I was probably 14, but oh. they, um, I guess they, they hadn't made as many movies and I think they didn't know how to talk to a young person. Mm. And especially since there was sexuality in the yeah, film, I think yeah. they were all a little bit nervous and Martin Scorsese did a lot of giggling, which you know he does anyway. <laughs> he does. A lot of giggling. How about De Niro? Uh, De Niro was like, I'll take care of this, you know, and then he would try and be serious and, uh, uh, I just watched them just be completely nervous and not know how to handle me, which was kind of funny. How did you feel? <laughs> I'd made a lot of movies at that point. Oh, I yeah. yeah. more movies she than both of them put together. She was the old so. pro at 12. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly, which is so cool. Now, now you have two sons. They're in their 20s. Yes. Um, but you say, and I'm so surprised at this, you say when they were kids, you made it a point to keep what you did for a living away from them. Yeah. Why? Because then you would have been the cool mom, right? Like, <laughs> well, I do you guess have I any just, regrets about I don't that? know why. I mean, I, I, I don't know why. I, I guess I didn't want them to know me that way. I think oh. that I wanted them to know me as their mom and uh, the person that, you know, went away to work and stuff, but I just didn't want them to be confused about what I did for a living. So I brought uh, my oldest son. He was probably about three. Well, he was three because I was pregnant with the other one. Uh, I brought him to set one day, and I gave him, bought him a little plastic tool belt and stuff, and I was like, yeah, and this is this set, and this set, and this set. And for a really long time, he thought I was a construction worker. <laughs> really? Yes, he thought I, I did construction. Like Tiger's mom. Yeah. 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 That's cute. Yeah. Well, now that they're in their 20s, yes. do you watch any of your movies with them? No, they have no interest in watching my movies with me. <laughs> I think they're going to catch True Detective, because they're really into oh. that. Um, and, uh, yeah, there's a few films that I would never show them because I'd be worried about being teased. Yeah. Uh, Nell, Nell, for example, I'd never seen because yeah. I knew that they do tease me often about that, <laughs> even though they've never seen the movie. Yeah.